Uh, hey guys, welcome back to another episode. My name is Mommy. We're back, and we have decided, me and the chat have decided that we're gonna get rid of our charm, and we're gonna put on the cross necklace, which increases our length of invisibility. Someone looked it up and said that the, the, the specific stat was about two seconds. We're trying this out. We have a swiftness potion and our last iron skin potion. Oh my god, gold and war. Did I write your name down? Golden war. Yes, I did. All right, so let's do this. And if we lose, if we die, we're going to have two truffle fishes left. And that's when I am going to use teleporters. You know, but look, at, I did have a small debate whether or not I wanted to because he summons tornadoes that stay in one place. They're static in an area. So if it goes on a teleport, I'm screwed. All right, here goes. Oh, my God. Come on. Wait, did I put it on? Did I put it on? Yes, I put it on. Ah, go, 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 go! Ah! Mr. Fish! Mr. Fish! Holy sh- Okay, here we go, here we go. Oh, God. Alright, um, sorry for the stream. I'm gonna try to not look at it for a while. I wanna focus on killing this guy. Give me a second. I run so fast using this thing. I can dodge him really easily. Look at this. Okay, okay, okay. This is good. This is good. This is good. Okay, I think I can outrun him. Definitely. But, because again, I, I was running before. I wasn't using my board, so I'm going to be running. Sorry, I'm not looking at the chat. Hold on, hold on. I got to focus. got to focus here. Once he gets in his second state, when he hits about maybe 40% health left, that's when he, I believe he moves a little bit faster, and I'm going to be in a lot of trouble. So we have a lot of damage now. Oh my gosh. Mr. Pygmy. The Stinger is so amazing. I can go ahead and destroy all of those detonating bubbles that he has. He's almost halfway dead. This could be it. This could be it. I don't know how many structures I've actually had to make and build for sp for a specific bosses. Um, is this, there's been a lot of bridges I had to make. Okay, I haven't taken a hit in a long time. This is great. Okay, except there. I jinxed it. Don't jinx them off. Alright, so we actually have about two and a half minutes. Where'd he go? Oh my god! He was transforming! Dun, dun, dun. I think we can start running. Oh god. Yes. Okay, okay. Oh, what? That hurt. That hurt. That really hurt, whatever that was. Okay, we have to run to the right soon because we're going to be coming to the area where it runs out. Oh! What the freak balls? This is it. Duke Fishron. I'm going to flush you down the toilet. My golden toilet. Yeah, so I'm gonna I'm gonna make him fit in the toilet. I don't give a crap. I'll chop him up into pieces, but he's going down there. He's almost dead. I hope he doesn't have another form. Oh my god. This is it. Oh my god. I'm so happy. We're about to freaking. Ow! That hurts. All right, keep up the speed. God damn. It. Okay, well, once he hits me again, I have to start running to the right though. Because we're running out of room. Oh no! Jesus. Hold on, guys. Hold on, guys. Leave me alone. 10 more seconds, tornado! <gasps> the tornado disappeared at the right time. That's good. That's good. I couldn't outrun this guy if I wanted to. Duke Fishron has been defeated. Thank you, guys. I think the actual, um... Oh, go pick up the items. The cross necklace actually did help out a lot. Dead. He's dead. He's gone. The bridge was an amazing idea. The bridge was an amazing idea. Hell yeah! Okay, what did he drop? Specifically, he dropped this. The Demonic Flare on. 87 melee damage, 23 critical strike, very fast speed, spews homing bubbles. Oh. That's, that's adorable. This is actually pretty good. If I were a Mita class, I would love to do this. We did it! I'm so happy though. Um, do I need to kill him for anything else? You know what? We have two more... Let's go fight him again. We have two truffle worms left. We know that we can do this. As long as I have my ver or my horizontal speed, we got this. I'm gonna fight him again. Best consultants. Thank you, thank you. You guys are great. We're gonna fight him again. I'm not gonna use this because I'm pretty much, you know, I have my armor that is specifically tailored to increasing my damage damage. Who wants a dance party? Does anyone know that dance party thing that you can put in chat? I forgot, it's like a dance party thing with some guys, I don't know. Anyway, we have a lot of time in this episode. We're still good. We're gonna fight him again. Uh, I don't know what else he can drop, but we're doing this. 
So one more boss left, and we have pretty much finished all the bosses in Terraria, and I'm done. I'm finally finished. But then, uh, like I said before, um, Awesome says, Hey, what's up? I'm going to write your name down. Welcome to the stream. Oh, Awesome. Hold on. Awesome says, Whoa. Awesome says, hi, Mobby. Drop the booth. Um, okay, like I said, after we finish the last boss, our Terraria series is done. But that does not mean we're going to finish uploading Terraria videos. I am going to start trying out um, custom maps, challenge maps, maybe different types of gameplay elements. And I want to install some mods, and we'll see how it is. Is Don't Starve going to be modded? Um, yes, my, my Don't Starve is most definitely modded. We'll be playing that later today during the 24-hour stream, of course. Flareon is awesome. I love Flareon. Um, what's it called? Oh, the last boss. The last boss is going to be from the Pumpkin Moon. No, 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 not, not the Pumpkin one. Is that the Pumpkin one? No, wait. Wait a minute. What is my last boss? The other event that is not the pumpkin, because I killed the pumpkin king. What is the other event? I know there's there's one more event I need to do, right? I started emptying out of world terraria a couple of weeks ago, digging out every single block. Jesus Christ! Yeah, I, I would assume. I would assume it's that crazy. All right, we're gonna fight this guy again. Let's see this. Also, I'll try to do my best to see your YouTube channel soon. I still have a lot to do for the summer. So sorry, I haven't able to see you YouTube. Oh, no problem. Thank you. Thank you, though, as long as you're, you know, you're here now and your intentions are good, thank you so much. Also, your support and all that stuff is awesome. The Christmas event, the Ice Queen. I don't think I'll be able to fight the Ice Queen. The Frost Moon. Okay, so the Christmas event is different from the Frost Moon, right? Okay. The Frost Moon. How do I activate the Frost Moon? I don't even know. I had the Ectoplasm. Oh, that's right. To get the Frost Moon, you have to use... I have the materials, don't worry, I have the materials, but, okay, what is the the boss character in Frostmoon? I know it's waves, right, but then there's different, like, um, there's like a boss tier monster, like the strongest. Once I kill him, that's it. I killed everything I can here. How do you make the hoverboard? What station? I don't remember. I do not remember. What station? Alright, we're summoning Sky again. Um, if we get the trophy, that's freaking awesome. Frostmoon is the Christmas wave thing. Starbound? Oh my god, I have Star- Oh my god. Alright, I have Starbound, and I've actually played it a long- a lot when it came out. But the thing is, it's still in its very early stage, and there's not much to do. But there are a lot of mods, I'll give you that. There are a lot of mods in there, but the game itself is not done. I do- uh, I do follow the blog that the uh, creators have. Uh, they, have they have a Starbound blog, which they do a lot of updates every single day. They're adding a lot of new stuff. Uh, but not necessarily putting out patches every, you know, day or something like that. Santa, NK1. Santa and the Ice Queen, so... Those are the two enemies in there? I absolutely don't understand a single thing about this advanced game talk. Eh, not really advanced. I mean, we're talking about what? We're talking about Santa and Ice People. So, it's gonna be really crazy. And, um, I just hope- I know I have enough materials to make at least one summon to do the events. Um, if I end up dying, we're gonna have to farm, keep farming all the good stuff. Frost Moon equals Ever Scream, Santa NK1, and Ice Queen. So I gotta kill those three, and then we're done. Kill those three, and we're done. This, this, this boss is a joke. I can close my eyes, run to the left, and kill him all I want. Well, I gotta point towards his general direction still. So. Oh my god! Excuse me, Mr. Fishron. Jesus, our horizontal speed is so fast. How much bullets do I have? 1500, yeah, we got enough. Rust 2. Play Rust, huh? I would love to try it, but I don't want to buy it. Oh no, did he despawn? Oh god, he's... Okay, okay. Has your anvil ever disappeared? Because mine randomly did. No, I have a multiple, and have, they have not. Yeah, I, I just don't want to purchase Rust, because it's a little too early for me. Oh my god. Oh my god. I think we're actually killing them a lot faster than we did before on the other kill. Or maybe it's because I anticipated the kill and it actually made my mind think- OH GOD! It's awesome, we haven't had to use a potion yet until now. Don't bother with Rust. Yeah, I don't want to play Rust just yet. I'd rather play- Well, there's a lot of games actually. A lot of games with the open world type of stuff. Yeah, like I said, I'd try it, 
But I wouldn't buy it. And I doubt that's a game where they give you a free demo. Alright, I think I'm hitting him. I don't know. Alright, I don't even know how much money he dropped that first time. I'm actually gonna check how much ice. Okay, so we started, we killed him the first time without any gold. So if I press my inventory right now, that's how much gold he gave us, pretty much. I like how this boss barely like came onto the scene just a couple of months ago. I want to play Binding Isaac Rebirth. Have you seen my um, Binding Isaac Community Remix mod gameplay? Oh my god, it's so fun. It has some of the mods, some of the items in there. Oh, one gold. Let's... Alright, let's see what he drops. Aha! We got the Razor Blade Typhoon. 66 magic damage. 18 mana each. Creates fast-moving Razor Wheels. We'll try it out. That's pretty cool. It bounces off the walls. Nice. Yeah, I, I, I'd, I'd assume it's better if you got friends, but uh, I don't know. I'm not gonna make all my friends buy it just so I can make a video of it. <laughs> all right, um, let's actually look up what else he can drop to see if it's worth it. Uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys. I'm still on the YouTube video, by the way, but I'm just gonna show you guys. We're, we're, we're gonna go to the Wikipedia. We're going to the wiki, and we're gonna see exactly what he drops, because I want to know exactly if we're done. So the Frost Moon event is next. We got a lot of guys to kill. Um, so we have to kill. Ever scream Santa and Kane the Ice Queen. This is the final boss. The final boss. So once we kill Ice Queen, Terraria is done with. Um, let's look at the fish run though and see what else he drops. I want to see if he drops anything that I can use in my build. So he drops um, fish on wings. That'd be cool. Tsunami. What is Tsunami? Bubble gun. Let's look at that. He drops Tsunami, which is a hard mode bow. It's a bow. Mm, no thanks. The bubble gun though. Oh, it's an awesome, it's a magic weapon too. Dang it. Um, no. I wanted something that would help Tempest. So he's pretty much not going to drop anything that I can use in my build, which is range. We're not going to fight him anymore. I did come twice in a row, so the first time was not a fluke. The second one was a lot more easier. So, yeah. All right. So let's see. How do we summon ourselves this Frostman again? Um, do, 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 do. Pumpkin, pumpkin, pumpkin. It, okay. Naughty Presence. Naughty presence crafting silk ectoplasm and solar frights. All right, no problem, no problem. Naughty presence. So we're definitely gonna try this out. Let's go ahead and get back in the game and do this. Pretty cool. We got at least two different items for him and and all the other stuff. So hmm, I'll keep the cross necklace on me, but right now we'll have this here. Razor blade, typhoon, flare on typhoon. This is awesome. Hmm, let's see. Let's put the melee weapon away. And we'll also put this range weapon away. No, it's magic. I'm sorry. It's magic. All right, so let's see if we have everything to craft it. Let's start just getting prepared to do this. Um, we need silk. So it's going to be in miscellaneous. I put that there. A lot of silk, which is easy to make. We have a lot of cobwebs. Should not have any problem doing that. We have a temple key. We don't have the mold though. That sucks. Flame traps. Hmm. All right. So what was it? Silks. Soul of frights. Let's look at the mob drops. I believe I put it in there. Mob drops. No, no, no. It's over here in ores and ingots. Soul of frights. We have a lot of these. Um, we can make five. Five of these. So soul of frights. Some silks and ectoplasm. Let's see how much we can craft now. Mobby, I would recommend getting the candy corn launcher. Candy Core Launcher, I'm assuming that is going to drop during the Frost Moon event. I mean, obviously, you guys can say, I recommend getting this, but I can't unless it just drops, pretty much. So let's go ahead and make it. Here it is, the naughty, naughty, naughty presents. We can make two at the moment. So two. Just two. And we can make three more, but we need, oh no, we need more ectoplasm. So let's go ahead and just get enough silk to craft one more, and then we'll have three. And then if I run out, we're going to have to craft more by farming so let's go back to miscellaneous some cobwebs to make a lot of silk oh it's from pumpkin dang i killed pumpkin three times and he did not drop it dang it all right where was i making again how do i craft the silk how do i craft the silk i need the loom here's the loom let's make our silk huh Bzzz. all right Coolios. I'm gonna get rid of it. Alright, so we absolutely do not need this pumpkin anymore. Fireflies, whatever. 
All right, pumpkin. I'm gonna put you away. You are in the greenery area here. All right. Anything else I need? Just need to put away worms. Whatever. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not fishing anymore. Screw that. Greenery. All right. Ectoplasm. Soul of fright. All that good stuff. All right. One more naughty present. So we're definitely gonna try this. But in the next episode. So if you guys enjoyed, leave a like. It helps so much. And if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. I upload a lot of daily videos. More Terraria on the way. We are almost done. I do not know. I do not know. Oh my god, what was that? I do not know how long it's going to take for me to actually beat these bosses. But we're going to try. So thanks for being here. And I'll see you guys next time.